Hello everybody, welcome back to the world of me. My name's Cougar and this is another episode of our Amazon review series. Got another uh, product in today that was sent to us by a company and uh, they wanted us to kind of check it out for them. And uh, right here obviously is the box. As you can see there is a few different little pieces in here. And what this is, is a knife sharpening set or kit. Uh, now, of course, a few things are wrapped up. Uh, first thing we'll go over right here. This is actually a, uh, basically a leveling stone or a smoothing stone. Uh, you can see it has these very deep grooves in it. And this itself is an extremely hard material, uh, sort of a pumice-like material. And it's very hard, much harder than the materials that are used to make the stone, uh, the sharpening stone. So what you'll do is, of course, run it across there once you've used this a certain amount of times. If you get any cupping or anything like that, you want to make sure that you can keep that flat so that you get a nice clean edge on your blades. And that's what this is there for. Very nice thing that they actually send this with the kit. Now here's another piece they have, and this piece here is actually for uh, gauging and getting the right angles on your knife. What it is, is, uh, is you, if you can see, and it's very difficult kind of to, to see, I'm sure, through the camera, but uh, you've got these sides right here, and those are the sides that are going to be placed against the against the uh, stone itself. So they're made in such a way that they uh, are not gonna wear down like the rest of this, which is all made of plastic. I believe these are uh, ceramic rods. And uh, so those are going to glide across the uh, surface of the stone. And uh, what it is is this center section, this longer piece here is actually folded over. So what you do is you actually slide your knife in there. And then the last one is, well, two pieces which is the stone itself and the basically the anti-slip mat that you put it in now this stone if you can see here on the side the blue section is the more coarse side and that's 1000 grit and then the white section here is the higher grit side which is 6000 grit all right so here we go uh, I've gotten one of my knives that I've used a little bit it's uh, taken the edge down a little uh, it also didn't help that I forgot to uh, to uh, oil the edge of it a little bit, and so there's a little bit of rust on there, some surface rust that I want to go ahead and get off. Uh, and so we're going to go ahead and try and take care of that. I got a little bit of water here. Obviously, I put down a uh, some uh, some paper here to keep uh, the garbage off of the table. Now I have it on a little bit of an angle, and that's because I have that curve on there. So we'll go ahead and try and follow that curve. Now, what I'm seeing here, I can actually see where the metal's coming off of the blade and kind of making a mark on the stone itself. I can see the edge, a little bit of the, the edge has been cleaned off there, and uh, so I do believe that it's working reasonably well. All right, so I did a handful of uh, handful of passes there, and I can definitely see where this is taking the edge of this down. Uh, I do have a fair bit to uh, to do to clean this up. Uh, the rust on some of the edges is a little deeper than I expected, so it will take me a while to get this done. But uh, this, I'm I'm very impressed. This this works very nicely. Um, I think actually the way the grit on this one works. Um, it, I think it was better even than the previous one I had. So I'm rather impressed, especially for a kit that has all three pieces. Usually stones themselves, especially ones in the, you know, in the higher grit range, you got a thousand and six thousand uh, grit on this. And that's usually a lot more expensive, uh, especially when you get up into the super high ones. But uh, I think this was uh, a pretty good, uh, a pretty good balance with having everything there. If you guys want to check this out, you can go down there in the description below. Of course, there's going to be a link to this down there. There's also, of course, the links to uh, the social media and the PayPal link that, of course, takes over for Patreon if you'd like to support the channel. Uh, don't forget to, of course, leave a thumbs up and 
hit that subscribe button as well as the bell icon. And those, of course, will let you get notified when we got new videos here on World of Me. All right, everybody. Well, my name's Cougar. This is the World of Me, another episode from the Amazon Review Series. I'd like to wish you all a good day, and I will see you later. Bye.